Welcome back everyone. There's a fella called Lee sent us a message the other day. He says, Adam, two minutes. He says, Adam, would you like, with that, still not like that, is it? He said, Adam, would you like a radio controlled Sierra Cosworth? Uh, yes, please. So he sent this box out and would hide me address because uh, there's some sneaky people out there. Uh, I've got no idea what's in. He's just sent it out the other day, I didn't just got it. Right, there we go. Right, so in the box, let's see what we've got. By the way, my car is, it's been there off for ages. It was originally, it was originally an Escort Cosworth. It's a Tamiya, I think it's called a TT01 or something. But in the box, right, let's see what we've got. I'm excited, I'm excited. I love, I love little projects like this. Got a body shell. Shut up, man. Literally have it for ages for a good radio controlled body shell. And there's none, I think K Kiyoshua or Kiyoshu will do one. But it's not very good, but the, the detail on this one. Look at that, let's get that focus. You see? Look, oh, it's got the little, it's got everything. It's RS500. It's got the headlights, the little Ford badge, the bonnet vents. Cool. Let's see what else is in the box. Some stickers for the window. Oh, ha -ha, headlights and everything. I think I'm going to do mine like, like my car, like white. But it looks like you can do it, um, looks like you can do it like a race car, look, it's got all the little stops that go on the bonnet and that. All the little stickers. Got a standing knife, cutting the body shell out. Some wheels. The white though. I wonder why they're white. Right, we've got some wheels. We've got the more wheels. Spoilers. They've even got the little mirrors. Little stickers for the mirrors. We've got some glue. Don't know what's in here. Spray paint. Ah, it's a silver one, so that must be for the wheels. Tyres. 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 A speed controller, because I did tell Lee that mine's not out on this car. It doesn't work, so hopefully this one will fix it. We'll try that. And two boxes. Let's see what's in here. l, &L models. Cup. I used to mess about with these when I was a kid. Like before I was driving like a real car, this was like my hobby, like messing about with these. And remember, you've got to wash this out, then you spray it from the inside so it makes the outside nice and shiny. Let's get cracking. And obviously you don't, you don't want your windows white, right? So what you do is you get these stickers, and these like kind of mask the windows. So we're just going to clamp these on, then we'll give it a, just a couple of coats of white paint and just get it looking nice, just get it looking nice. Have a look what we've got. Whatever they call us, whatever they'll do, they're running in circles, circle our fools. Whatever we will means get nothing to prove. But in the dark, it's starting to. Get mad, just decide the deals to do. What else we need to do is, you see these, these are the spoilers for the car. I've got some white paint, so we're going to paint these as well. Because obviously green, green spoilers won't work. But it's a proper little RS500 spoiler, it's got the little lip and everything on the back. Oh, there's a choice of two wing mirrors. And the low raised spoiler, that'll be black. Do you know what? I think these have been 3D printed. I'm pretty sure they have. I've got some black paint in the garage door for the lower spoiler. You see where it all fits together? But there, watch it. We'll just give it a quick, quick mop up. Cool. Oh, we've gone there. We'll get the paint. We'll give this as paint. I'm going to use the washing line. I'll get knocked if I paint this in the house. This colour is white knight. You mustn't do for diamond white. It's like a special paint, it's like flexible, so if like you crash it with curb it doesn't chip off. Pretend to dream surrounded by ghosts in white. Leave this here to dry off. Got a little selection of wing mirrors here. These bits need to be black. 
Then these bits need to be white, like the wing mirrors and the spoiler. We'll have to go in the garage, it's too windy out there. Whatever they call us, whatever they Give them a quarter latte, just to give them a bit of shine. I don't know what this is dry like, it might dry like matte or satin or something. These bits have had about two hours or something, so I'm just going to move this to one side, then we'll paint something else. I think all the parts are like 3D printed, but they're like the really good quality. They look pretty cool. Like little BBS split rims, like what's on actually my car. But for these, obviously they're no good white, so I've got some uh, silver paint just to give them a quick ch ch ch. That's what we're going to do. Quick ch ch ch. Whatever they call us. Move the words out of the way, then we'll do the spoilers. For the spoilers, I've got the finest spray paint to see. It's called Auto Extreme. It's a pound from the pound shop. Matte black. It's a good shape. Leave that to dry, then we'll come backward. Done. Done. Right, so it's all painted up, right? Painted the shell. Painted the shell. Painted the spoilers. These are 3D printed. Painted the wheel silver. First, I'm just going to remove these bits on the windows, just so you see the windows. This just peels off. We'll put the stickers on, look, I've got like a load of stickers, like headlights and backlights and window trims and all kinds. It's just stickers, you just peel them off, look. Lee, the lad that makes these, he did see it, he's only got like two and car style headlights. I think this is like for a Texaco RS500. You can literally get a full Texaco RS500 sticker kit. Come together, can he, isn't it? I love stuff like this, just messing about with little little toy things. Need to grow up really, but uh, we've, got, we've got a sticker here for the grill for the bumper, like the long one. For this little grill here, you get like you set this like the one what you have to drill and stick in. But I'm going to put the sticker on because these are stickers and it'll look more similar. Do you know what I mean? If that makes sense. Nearly there, man. Ford badge to pull on. I think that's about it. What do you think we should do next? Fit the, the spoiler. Just gotta get a little drill, just bum bum. We'll fit the spoiler. I'll get me drill two seconds. What I might do, right, if I can get a steady hand, is just get like a, a sharpie, like a little marker, and just do all the little trim around the bumper, like the door handles and that, just to give it that extra little final touch, do you know what I mean? But it looks cool, doesn't it? Doesn't it look cool? Let's cut it out. There we go, it's all cut out. 
Like I say, you know what, I might get a black marker and just do like the split along the bottom, like some little, some little detail bits. Do I need a little reg player for the front of it with my car reg on? That's it, it's all built up. We'll go and take it out. I bet it's been two months since I've been out in this car. Feels a lot different to drive to the Subaru, obviously, this is a lot older. This feels like it feels quicker this, it feels a lot quicker than the Subaru but the Subaru is nicer to drive and the has Subaru handles a lot better this when you put your foot down it kind of gets a bit skitsy whereas obviously the Subaru is four wheel drive just pop up to wear <laughs> wheel spin not used to that after the Subaru kind of beat the sound of a cosy like <laughs> Find like a bit of flat tarmac where there's no one about. This'll do. Get me caught on, winter's coming. It's been this like, it looks exactly like mine, but mini. Like you can tune these, you can get like new motors and that for them. This one's totally standard. It's an old Tamiya model that was originally like an Escort Cosworth. Oh, need some driving lessons. Might curb me wheels there. Tell you what, I wish my car handled like this. I might have to get you water for this. If you want one of these, I'll leave all the links below. You can get like Texaco RS500. You can get like Texaco RS500. I'm still playing with the name of mine while I'm talking. You can get like Texaco RS500 ones. Is there? Obviously, mine's just like a normal road car. Battery's last in ages, eh? I'm going to leave you guys here. I'm going to sit and play with this till the battery goes flat. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. I'm Victor.